In a little pub in London, Moriarty drank his beer and recited one of the stories of his exploits far and near. Now an Irish song says Kelly, best of all that one and all, and Moriarty sang for them the hills of Donegal. They were cheering at the finish and they called in core in core. But Moriarty said, lads, I can't sing any more. He stood there sad and silent, gazing down upon his beer, and in his eyes that glistened, just the starting of a tear. Are you going home for Christmas, the friendly bard met said. Moriarty fixed his gaze on her and slowly shook his head. Sure I haven't been to Ireland now this twenty years or more. My mother hardly know me if I walked up to the door. I was born, said Moriarty, in an island in the west. The last place God created was the first place that he blessed. We were poor but we were happy in our own sort of way. God, I wish I was a lad whistling there today. My father got be good to him, but drawn a woeful night. And my mother left our lonesome herself and me to fight. So with Jimmy Moore McCarty and young Don Roe O'Shea, I sailed across to London to earn an honest pay. I promised my dear old mother I'd soon be home again. But the curse of drink came on me, and it slaved me in its chains. Should have been to Ireland now this twenty years or more. She still be waiting for my footsteps at the door. Then someone started singing tree amid the winter snow. It was like an old bell ringing so far and long ago. And as Moriarty listened, he pushed his glass away and he made a solemn promise he'd come home for Christmas Day. He scraped every penny into his hands. And coming up to Christmas, he sailed for Ireland. His heart was light and merry. He felt content and blessed. As the train rolled through the Midlands and brought him to the West. In the village of Kinchila, that night upon the shore, he saw across the waters dark his island home once more. The moon and stars were shining. The brightness of the dome seemed to hang over the island called Moriarty home. "'Tis a grand night for the crossing," said the boatman Thomas Bond. Moriarty didn't know him till a lifetime I am gone. And as he clegged into the body in, the boatman heard him say, "'Glory, glory, God of heaven, I'll be home for Christmas Day.'" Lester is sad now, but in a lodging house in London, Moriarty is poor aboard. In a hall and a table lay a message unread. Message was, this morning your poor mother passed away. She be buried in Kilsheila in Donegal after Mass on Christmas Day. Sit down.